Morning. Laura, Jim, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. Sorry about that. It's, uh... no, no problem at all. So I guess I just wanted to hear from you in a really relaxed way. Uh, Jim, tell me a bit about some of the challenges that you faced. Right. I guess the biggest challenge was that we were dealing with completely uncharted waters. Um, everyone in the tourism industry knew that sooner or later there would be a downturn. And so, uh, Jim, what were the sort of biggest learnings from all of that? I mean, it is a crisis of unrealistic proportion. Firstly, the resilience of our community. Um, and um, if I look at it now, I'm amazed that we've had the small number of businesses fail that have actually failed. Mm. Um, uh, employers here have been, have been terribly resilient. Employees have been flexible, found ways to make do in the meantime. Um, I am very, very proud of the community that I'm honoured to uh, lead. And I guess one of the biggest challenges really is how we're going to manage that growth all of a sudden from quite a low base and how we um, manage to retain employees and provide the services that we want to so that tourists have a great time. One of our big challenges at the present time, and that is lack of employees. Yeah. You know, so here we go from where we were last year with the town dying with no customers, to the biggest concern for ski season coming up is lack of um, lack of staff. Oh well, Jim, thank you so much. I really appreciate your You're comments, welcome. and um, yeah, it's been fantastic to get to chat to you. And congratulations on your outstanding leadership.